Take a look at this. That is a tree right through the windshield of that car. The crash this morning, sending the driver behind the wheel of that car to the hospital. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live tonight in Fort Lauderdale. So, Peter, you spoke with some family members of that woman. How is she doing tonight? Well, Rick, they're grateful she was not seriously injured. They're amazed by these new pictures that we're going to show you. They also tell us she was run off the highway by at least one other vehicle. Now she's recovering from this freak accident here at Broward Health Medical Center. A close-up shot from Chopper 4 shows a stunning sight, a tree limb shooting through the front windshield of this black 2004 Honda Civic. The driver could have been impaled. Instead, she was brushed by pieces of this tree and received only minor injuries, according to FHP. Photos from Davy Fire Rescue show how she could have lost her life on I-75 just south of Griffin Road. Yeah. How do you feel about this whole thing? We are very scared. We don't know, we don't know how he's here. A worried Peter DeCampo and this woman came to Broward Health Medical Center after their cousin, 29-year-old Francis Clemenza of Weston, was transported as a result of this accident. A seatbelt she was wearing may have prevented more serious injuries. Is she going to work? Was she driving to work? Yes. DeCampo says Clemenza was alone and headed southbound on I-75 to her office job in the Miami area. FHP says it was just before 9.30 in the morning when Clemenza, for some reason, veered to the right and struck road debris. Her car rotated and slid backwards into a tree. A tree limb broke through her left side rear window and front windshield. You see the pictures of the tree limb that no, went we in the didn't car? See nothing. While DeCampo had not seen these images when he spoke with us, he cringed when we told him about this tree limb. He says he was told by FHP what his cousin is saying about this accident. She, she tries to, to avoid it. Some car that goes to, to uh, toward her. her. So he he draw he do he like had this. To veer to the right. Yeah, and lost control of the car. Para no chocar con el carro. Clemenza's uncle he says he was told right, another right. vehicle cut right. into his niece's lane, and she was forced to veer to the right. Now work crews have been trimming trees and bushes in an ongoing project lately off I-75, just south of Griffin Road. But FHB tells us that was not a factor in this accident. It's not known how long Clemenza will be here at the hospital, but her uncle told me she is going to be okay. We're live from Fort Lauderdale, Peter Danch, CBS 4 News. Lucky lady, Peter. Thank you very much.